Hello, I'm Divya Gopalan, and these are the headlines on Al Jazeera. Iran's president says he is ready to enter a new round of talks aimed at ending the long standoff over his country's nuclear program. Hassan Rouhani spoke only hours after the U.S. president called for a push towards diplomacy with Iran. Our diplomatic editor, James Bays, has more. In President Rouhani's uh, speech, there was also a lot that wasn't conciliatory towards the, re the West uh, and uh, particularly uh, the U.S. He was critical, as we've heard so many times before, rather familiar with this, uh, critical of the U.S. military engagement in the Middle East, critical of drone strikes, critical of Israeli treatment of Palestinians. Some of the things that have always been in the speeches of President Ahmadinejad in the past, but the U.S. diplomats stayed in the room. The Western diplomats normally walk out when an uh, Iranian leader is speaking. Kenya's president says a group of al-Shabaab gunmen who had attacked a shopping mall in Nairobi have been defeated. Uhuru Kenyatta said five gunmen have been killed and another 11 suspects are being held. And a powerful earthquake has killed at least 80 people in southwestern Pakistan. The magnitude 7.8 quake was centered near the district of Awaran in Balochistan province. You can always find the latest on those stories and more at aljazeera.com.